Welcome, everyone, to the Home Depot College Football on CBS Sports as Tennessee and Florida renew their spirited rivalry. Swamp is sold out as it has been for every home game of the Steve Spurrier era. And these 85,000 fans make this the loudest outdoor venue in college football. And that is certainly the case tonight as the defending national champions come a calling to take on the home standing Florida Gators. The kickoff. He's the NCAA indoor champion of the 60 meters. Covered it in 6.58 seconds. This rivalry with a pullback offset in front of Jamal Lewis. They come out throwing. Martin jumps it off for Jamal Lewis. He side as a senior. Part because he earned it, and part because I wanted to carry it around and get a firmer handle. Nice move through traffic. Falling behind early. On the delay, Lewis hit in the backfield and dropped. Cedric Wilson and David Martin out wide. Lots of time for T. Martin. Throws to the far sideline too high. Wow, what a wild day it's been. Games involving SEC. A devastating blow, which they overcame. Here's Lewis running right. Good blocking on the corner. Lewis hit behind the line of it's Florida on offense for the second time. And the first running play receivers. Darrell Jackson, the motion man. Johnson throws the pay to Travis Taylor. Out of bounds at midfield. The left guard making his 33rd career start today. Man open. Darrell Jackson juggles. Tries to elude Goodrich. And Goodrich took a percent of the time. It averaged 70 balls. The play clock running yeah. out again. They got to get it off. Johnson just did. Johnson throws to the end zone. Too high for Jeff Chandler. Out of the hold of Billy Young. And that kick is good. He's in his 15th game, and he's 14-0, playing with a lot more confidence. And on the money there to Cedric Wilson. To take the Travis Henry, and Alex Brown has the sack. Send him a message, he needs to play harder. Blitz, Martin down again. In front of Jamal Lewis. Martin steps up to avoid the rush and throws a sinker short of Cedric Wilson. From the floor to 42. Great protection. And now Martin shows his running ability. He got hit at 35. Martin threw it right into the hands of Alex Brown. He picked it off. Travis Henry, the tailback, once. Travis Henry remains the tailback, following Bartholomew. Not for very long. Yes. T. Martin running out of room and down. Robert Gillespie in it tailback. Johnson going deep into coverage, and it's incomplete. Johnson straight back. Throws on the money that time. A flag down in the secondary. Darrell Jackson lost the football after picking up a first down. And the ball's got it. The floor to 32. The pitch to Jamal Lewis. Big hole. First down. On second and 17. It is a clean exchange, but Lewis doesn't get very much. He field goal for Loudermill. Martin throws, complete first down, Eric Parker. Not an automatic first down, and now they're trying to pick it up on the rollout by Martin. He has the first down, he lunges and has a touchdown. What a competitor T. Martin is. And he got an excellent block by Will Bartholomew. up after every round every time he goes to the sideline they're working on him Bo Carroll a real speedster runs back the louder mill kickoff big hole all the way to the 44 yard goes to the 15 a high pitch handled by Robert Gillespie but he's dropped for a loss the quarterback five wide receivers and here comes the blitz Johnson sidestepped it then threw it away that was the last game for Cooper as the kicker, Jeff Chandler, took over, and he's been almost flawless ever since. Jamal Lewis lined up in the eye, follows Philip Crosby, but never gets out of the back. People said the national championship was lucky last year. They're still not ranked number one, even with much of their team back. 
but also in recruiting. He'll look to Auburn in 94. 29 wins in a row at home since for the Gators. The throw high from T. Martin. That's a halftime report. Still six minutes left in the half. Martin pumps and goes deep. And it is incomplete through the hands of Cedric Wilson. The deep substitutes. Doug Johnson, quick toss. Travis Taylor out to the... Johnson, another quick hitter to Travis Taylor. Same play as a moment ago, this time the number one quarterback. He throws the fade, and it is caught by Darrell Jackson. Over on is in large part because he stuck around this summer rather than go play minor league baseball as he's done the previous two. That pass is broken up. The play, as a result, the blitz is on. Oh. Wide open, the tight end. Aaron Kinney. Touchdown! Flagged down at the four-yard line. During the run, face back on the offense. 15-yard penalty from the spot of the foul. They play yard line. Johnson out of the gun throws. Almost intercepted of the Gators. Deep drop, trying to set up a screen, it seems. Johnson lost the football on an incomplete pass. 7-6, Tennessee. In the second quarter, that pass caught. And it is good. And Tennessee for 79 yards. 5 for 50 against Florida. Martin, the keeper. And as Henry stumbled, but still managed to stay on his feet. Doug Johnson out of the shotgun. Pump fake. Zips it to the sideline. Caught. That was his first catch tonight. Out of the gun. Johnson guns it to the end zone for a touchdown to Daryl Jackson. The handoff to Ernest Graham, and he's around the field. Graham again breaks into the secondary. Across midfield and down to the Tennessee 41. Relatives with him on campus in Knoxville earlier this week as the hurricane moved towards South Carolina. That pass Mary's tab. Short drop, slings it to his right, juggled, and incomplete. Ernest Graham, the lone back, he stayed in the block. The pass caught by Willis. First down and more. Alex Willis, top Florida. Trying to add to a nine-point edge. That pass is juggled and caught. Jeff Chandler's been perfect in field goals, and those three kicks the difference in the score. Top run by Gillespie, and the girl comes in. At a wideout position, they throw to the near side. Rache Caldwell, touchdown! Jackson got three pins. Off the play action. And here is play action on second and eight. Good for a first down. Wilson taking the head coaching job at... Oklahoma, Martin throws it out to the near side. The hurry. First and 15, a blitz. Well picked up. And the pass, very close to a first down. Parker did a little down, came on a 32-yard drive. They used a short field. Here's Gerard Warren. Warren, 6'4", 300 pounds. Brown has Martin again. Alex Brown, third and long again. Third and 16, Dante Stallworth in as the third wide out. The pass too hot to handle. Phil Pierce to stand front. 71. Philip Fulmer is on the team. He's now 49 years old. Johnson slipped through a wounded duck, and there's the big break they need from Dion Grant. Back in the game after a back injury. 16. From the 15-yard line, the throwback screen. Cedric Wilson inside the five. Jamal Lewis into the air, took off a long way from the goal line and pulled back Bartholomew also into the game, leading the way for Jamal Lewis, who scores a touchdown. Tennessee trying to take advantage of another turnover. And the quick pass. Time receiver. Brown's a big time end tonight. Five sacks for Florida. Three for Alex Brown. And almost ten. Here comes Brown again, and he rips him down. And here comes the blitz. 
And there goes Graham, running right. He's from a Gator family. Roberts and both parents attend. Tafoya tells us that Travis Taylor will not return. But Willis is doing a great job filling the void. Doug Johnson hands off to Ernest Graham, and he stumbles in the backfield. Big blow to the ball's comeback hooks here. Tennessee comes on a blitz. They haven't been able to get Johnson all night. He scrambled away, cuts up the field. The pitch to Graham. And oh, Graham vacates. Johnson keeps. Wow. That's going to be very close. Based on that spot, I don't think I he think got Tennessee it. held him. I think it was a good heads-up defensive play by John Chavis' defense. They lost yardage. Yes, they did. Needed to reach the 17. And stopped on this one. Play action pass. Martin throws. B. Martin 12 out of 29. And that pitch was there, but not as athletic as some of their other offensive linemen. The pass too high. Looking for Dante Stallworth, the red shirt freshman. Robert Trillmarty had people rushing. They bring more here, and he throws to the outside. Terrific catch by Daryl Jackson. Leading scorer in Florida high school basketball history. Here's Graham again. Thank you, Michelle. Graham. Run down to three. We're taking the snap. On third and six, he throws off the hands. And Ryan the punt. He took over after Wazalewski had a short punt. Ryan trying to drop it near the goal line. On first down from the end zone, the pass batted down. Guess who? Alex Brown. And after the incompletion, second and ten. Martin, a good fake, but he has his man, the tight end, John Shearer. Martin throws too high. Well below 50% tonight. Under siege all night. Great catch on the far sideline by David Martin. And Travis Henry and Jamal Lewis in the game at the same time, but it's Martin. Siblings, he had to serve as a role model for. Brown has Martin again. Martin throws. It's a season when they did get a controversial pass interference call. Call against Syracuse. Here's a long pass to Parker. He stayed on his feet. He's down to the 18. On second and 10. A big hole for Lewis inside the 10. And down into this game. Now Tennessee threatening to get very close. Lewis up and over and in for a touchdown. <laughs> We've had about four or five D helmeters. Johnson's going to throw. Huh. Jackson trying to break away. Darrell Jackson for 163 yards. Graham trying to run left. He stacked up. Eric West. Graham from putting the ball on the ground. Spur gave him the hook. Johnson going deep, and it is intercepted again. Deion Grant out of bounds at midfield. Tennessee has not kicked a field goal this year. They've only attempted one, and it was a bad miss. Jamal Lewis. 100 yards or more. This is his 15th career game. Martin slipped, completing his the place kicker. Nothing on that play. The pitch to Lewis. He has a long way to go. He isn't close. Back to the line of scrimmage, and that's all. And they have Gillespie with the fumble problems of Graham. The ball carry. He surges out. Cut back inside. Gillespie bounces off the pile. He's short of a first down. Gillespie, all kinds of room outside. He cut back to stay in bounds. That should do it for the Gators. Johnson takes it in. Go Florida, which won five in a row. Head to head with Tennessee before last year's loss. Will they get six out of seven? against the ball and if the balls thought this would be the victory at last at the swap that gives them the respect they've been looking for it won't happen tonight john hope said he normally is a great sleeper but he woke up thursday morning or friday morning about 4 30 a.m seeing plays he said something's up something's different about this game he should sleep well tonight because his defense played a great great football game and so did doug johnson